Father Sean Doggett, parish priest of Our Lady Help of Christians in Bolio St. George, says there is a shortage of nuns in the Catholic Church and not much interest has been shown by young people in Grenada to join the faith in this regard. In an exclusive interview with GBN, the parish priest says he would also like to see more commitment from young men towards the teaching profession and joining the priesthood as well. Uh, yes, I can say we are seeing a shortage because when you have um, when you have a congregation of nuns, for example, running a school, uh, they put their salaries, if they're paid by the government, they put their salaries into the school, into the congregation. They don't put it into a personal bank account to build their own house or whatever. So that obviously is a very, very big help to, um, to the institution, the school or the hospital or whatever it may be that they are running. And yes, there is a shortage. We wish we could see more, more young ladies, especially here in Grenada, offering their lives um, in that way. The parish priest explained the importance of having nuns looking at the caring aspects of their lives as what they are called to do. Franciscan Sisters of the Sorrowful Mother, their first main charism is education, teaching, teaching young people. And here in Grenada, they started St. Rose Modern Secondary School, and um, that has been developed. But then other needs arise, and um, and they... they um, they get involved in those, in other works as well. So, for example, some of the sisters of that congregation are involved in health ministry and nursing and uh, even in, um, in psychological counselling and so on. And um, also, not in Grenada, but in other countries, they're also involved in hospitality and caring for uh, vagrants and um, needy people and um, uh, looking after the, the, the poor, looking after the poor. Father Doggett says there are programs designed to attract young people. He explained the role of the sisters, which he says differ based on their congregation. As often as 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 long as there is a need for children to be educated and people to be cared for, um, uh, there will be a need for nuns of women and men who dedicate their whole lives to that particular work within the church for the love of God. Um, if we go back to the Bible, back to the first letter of St. Paul to the Corinthians, chapter 7, especially verses 32 and verse 34, Jesus speaks about the, the unmarried woman can devote herself to the Lord, whereas the married woman, her main emphasis, her main focus of her life is on her husband and her children. And the same for a man, a married man, his first commitment is to his wife and to his children. The unmarried man should give that same kind of commitment to God and to the people to whom he is sent, among whom he works. Christina John, GBN News.